Welcome back, it's me Lou. I'm here for another action figure unboxing and review, and today from Hasbro in their Star Wars Black Series line, we are featuring Axe Woves from Star Wars The Mandalorian. Alright, so this is a somewhat older action figure. Um, I've had it in my uh, to review pile for a while now, it's just now that I'm getting around to it. Um, I was kind of prompted to review them just because uh, today was April 19th, 2023, and they aired the season 3 finale of The Mandalorian, which Axe Wolves appeared in. So I kind of felt appropriate that, you know, I should review the guy today. <laughs> Not sure when I'll upload this video, but at least I'll get this review done with. Alright, so uh, first impressions of the figure. Uh, it looks great. Um, the likeness to actor Simon Cassianides looks pretty decent. Um, nice portrait on the box. And a bio, Axe Wolves. A skilled warrior, Axe Wolves is loyal to Bo-Katan and is a member of a band of Clan Kree's Mandalorians striking back at the Imperial Remnant. Alright. So cool looking action figure, really heroic character, and he looks fantastic. Um, love the Black Series line. I've kind of slowed down over the last um, two years with the Black Series stuff. Uh, mostly because, you know, partially was the price increase and there's so much. <laughs> there's so much. And I, I, not that I felt the need to buy everything, but at a certain point I kind of just told myself, you know, as long as I have characters from, like, the core movies, I think I'm happy. Unless there's something like, you know, from maybe a Disney Plus show that I really, you know, feel attached to. Okay, so we have Axe Wolves. Looks cool. Um, I'm going to leave his blaster in the tray for now. There's all this dust that kind of came off the figure. Uh, here's the backpack. Standard Mandalorian issue with the missiles. Looks pretty cool. It kind of has that uh, slot that's reminiscent of the old uh, projectile from the classic figure. And then you have the three tabs to insert into his back. Now the helmet, very familiar. It has the rangefinder, which can fold down. And then we have Axe Wolves. Again, the likeness to actor Simon Cassianides is pretty decent. Uh, some weathering and battle scarring on the armor. Now he has the brown tunic underneath with the gray overlay. You see his holsters. Blue gauntlets, black gloves. You know, he kind of really fits in with Bo-Katan's little militia. Uh, his head rotates, looks down, arms move, and you'll notice that the shoulder pauldron, uh, it's attached, even though it's an independent piece, it's attached to this kind of like, I can't describe it, it's almost like a ring that is inserted underneath the, the joint. So if you rotate it, it can actually move in tandem with the arm, which is nice, as opposed to other figures in the past where the pauldron would be attached to the top. Uh, his elbows bend, single uh, joint, single pin, uh, pinless design, articulated uh, wrists. You'll notice that he has a mid-torso cut, so you can kind of roll around, crunch, arch back. No waist swivel. Uh, legs kick up. i um, guessing single pinned knee and knee swivel and articulated ankles. And let's get his helmet and uh, jet pack on. I kind of regret not getting the Death Watch Black Series figures. Um, I still might change my mind. The only reason why I kind of I didn't pull the trigger on those is because uh, with the older Clone Wars action figures from the three and three quarter line uh, from years ago, I, ha I amassed such a large collection of Mandalorians, and at this point, I kind of feel like with the Black Series, I'm just doubling up on certain characters. But the Black Series Death Watch figures looked amazing. I just didn't want to like commit to like army building like a handful of them. 
But there he is, fully outfitted with his jetpack and helmet. It looks cool. You know, you could buy a couple of these, maybe do a head swap and just uh, run them as generic um, cannon fodder uh, for bo army. But overall, beautiful figure, as always, from Hasbro. All right, so with that being said, let's wrap this one up. Uh, once again, my name is Lou. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you are a returning viewer or subscriber, thank you so much for your continued support. I greatly appreciate it. So until the next video, be safe, take care of yourself, buy lots of toys, and most importantly, be happy. And I'll see you at the next one. All right, later.